another cutscene. This game won't have many cutscenes. These two are... There must be like... 10? At most? Well, plus one for each time you clear a certain event. There are not many. So, we start the game. We got our first event. Find the hundred year old wise man. So let's read the signs as he said. Whom it may concern, please stop stealing my mail. If you continue, perhaps I cannot be responsible for what might happen. As regards Mr. Proprietor. What? People are stealing the mail? Let's do the same! Yay! Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh. And we got the tornado. Nice. Press the triangle button. You see your inventory screen. You, you don't have much for now. And the weirdest thing is, if you press the select button, you get this menu. You can choose like events, to see the events you have, and the events you cleared. Which for the time being is none. See? Find the, the bracelet. There's the fog we just got. And the 100 year old wise man. Which is the second event we get. That's right, it's events, not quests or missions. So, shut up. But it's weird. If you press the select, you can choose... Maps, status, events... But if you only press the, press the triangle button, you can only view the items. It's kind of weird, but oh well. I can live with it. By the way, I'll be saying things you'll need to go along the way to complete quests in the future. For example... I won't give it now. I'll tell you the next time I... Okay. So this one's pretty obvious. We got to take the froggy home. So maybe we'll be looking for a pond or something. <laughs> It looks like an asset farts. You are an evil pig, you'll get with the fart in the face. Come on. I want to be sure you breathed it. It's a tiny! Let's catch it! Baby pig acquired. Another event for the future. There we go. You see, if, if you press this to the ground, it changes to orange. Or a darker color. You see, that one there is yellow. This one is orange. If you charge your shot and hit it, will drop out the tomato or one of these fruits. It gives you a hundred points and one health point. It doesn't have to be orange. It can be yellow or whatever you want. What the hell did you get up here? Wait, so he was the one that ordered that tornado? Wall climbs. Press up, then you range your man. Well, that's simple enough. 
you don't have to go in there yet, you can't do anything until much later in the game, so we won't. An egg! Let's catch it! Ooh, a chick! Well, this one is obvious. What the hell? Or where the hell did he start a tornado that huge? Well, like most games of the time, the most of the things didn't make sense. But they were still awesome, so who cares? Event cleared, yeah! Whoa, I was thinking I was gonna fall into water that, that time. Careful with the plants. They bite you if you come too close. And they jump. Hey, not fair! Damn you! Oh, it doesn't matter much. I'm gonna have to go back anyway. Hey! What the hell? It was a waste of time. I mean... For the pond we could just walk right and explore. The hundred year old man we already knew and we had to find him anyway. What's this? Ooh! An AP box! Not fair. One of those silly why did this thing happen things is why was he on top of a board and waiting for me to come on top of it so he could make me fall. Bananas! Oh well, back to shall we go. And uh, you're, you really are going to want to do this after you get the bananas. Go back. Oh, side note. If you don't catch that blue fruit and hit it like the way I did, you get a biting plant flower. When are you going to use it? Near the end of the game. Maybe. But you still should do it for the, the points and all that. Hey, I didn't know you were that close. Come here, Proggy. I'll take you home! Event cleared, we got a froggy home! Hooray! Maybe we'll visit her sometime. Or not, he can't swim.
but the guy is already spoiled. He said we couldn't go through until we, we could swim. And since he said that, people think, hey, we're going to be able to swim in the future. Yeah, we are. And I spoiled it a bit more for you. Oh well. I guess whoever sees this Let's Plays uh, is already going to be spoiled, so if you don't want to get spoiled, just pick up the game and play. If not, you can watch this or not. I don't force you. I can't force you. I can just really bug you to watch this or not. I'll try that. There is a branch up here. Ah, there we go. Swing, swing, swing. Well, that's pretty intuitive and also lots of the games do this. But this part is important. Uh, you just need to press the X button where you, you want to jump. It doesn't matter the timing. Just press and when he gets there, he'll jump. Somebody's in a bad mood today. There you go, take a banana! And this is one of the most important things you'll want to get in the whole game. Because it lets you run really fast and glitter, like Edward. From uh, Never mind, don't think about it. Well, another side note. You must have noticed that whenever I, I bite a pig, yeah, he bites them. He didn't realize that until... All these years have passed after I played the game when I was little, and then I saw someone complaining that he bu he beat his foes. Um, that I realized that he actually beat them. But it doesn't matter. It's still cool. It's uh, a different way of doing things. And uh, here we are at the hundred-year-old man. Why is that? Uh, you know what I mean. This thing right here. See? There you go. That's what we're going to do next. But we'll stop for here. I think I'm running out of time. So I'll save the data. Memory card one. Here is the save of my game clear. And here is the save of my last attempt at the playthrough that I uh, 